welcome to the new video and uh, this is Basit Ali from the YouTube channel the in the fluency address so I would like to welcome you all I hope you are enjoying good health so definitely I'm here with a new point of view and new topic then in this, this topic is about to how to read a newspaper then you have to go for it and you have to be very careful about reading a newspaper and it is always said that a newspaper is very stuffy and is it is all very bulky that it can never be read in a few seconds or in a few minutes okay but it might be wrong because someone has done it so far definitely we have we have the uh, we have the code points that we have to go go for that point that how to get the newspaper read in shorter way in a shorter time okay so, so the number one point is that you have to learn for the opinion section that has been regarded in the English newspaper it is always been told about the English newspaper okay I'm just uh, telling about you the English paper definitely uh, let me have a look about the uh, pages that this is the English newspaper that this is all about the down newspaper so you have to go for the uh, page number 8 or page number 12 it might be the page of opinion page okay you have to go for the opinion page and you you, you will look for the opinions of different columns different editors so in the former way that you can you can see that there is a point of view that you can have a uh, little sections on the corner sides of that editors or that columnist because they are they are the person who has already told about the society and they have just make made it clear about making their point of view and making their surveys in a better way and they are just express themselves in that editorials okay so go and look out for the editorials okay this is the first point the next point is that go always for the front page and go to the towards the highlights it these are the highlights all about for the day and for the news updates of that day of that particular day okay so go always about the highlights just like i would say and i would call about that there's a might strike that there is a labor strike of uh, there's a labor strike of uh, sugar mill factory and you have to look for and the government is also concerning their rules okay number third is that go for the last page and because last page also con con contains the uh, similar type of highlights of the day okay but it's also but it's but it not so necessary but it can be necessary as well because it can also include some kind of point that might be read out okay number fourth point is that always go for the international page because it includes the news about current affairs it would help you about to go for the current affairs go for that page okay this is the most peculiar point that you have to go with the series and go for the reading now this is the main question that how to read out the newspaper and which type of newspaper you should have to go for okay this is the main thing that we have the social broadcasters that is all about number one is bbc number second is cnn number third is uh, we can say jangir and number fourth is new york times because these are the uh, these are the new these are the papers that uh, that might include the news uh, about the daily and relevant stuff and you have to go for the editorials and you have go go for the highlights of the day and this is the way you can also read the newspaper number uh, another point is that you have to go for the hard paper in the form of dawn newspaper in the form of junk and in the form of a different uh, express paper uh, for the pakistan okay you can go for them in, by reading the newspapers in english you can extract different kind of new vocabulary and you have you can extract different kind of stages and strategies how to learning and develop your reading skills by skimming or scanning so that's all for the day that's all for the stuff and in this way you can express yourself by reading the newspaper in a shorter and a periodic time okay thank you thank you for all the thank you for all of you for having uh, watched my video and uh, don't forget to subscribe the channel the fluency Adders, and don't forget to hit the bell icon thank you this is basit ali signing off allah hafiz